Howdy all, it's your host Road here. Welcome back to Love It Games. Playing a little Final Fantasy 13 today, so I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We are about to run in and I believe we're about to do a boss battle. So let's see what we can get ourselves into. And let's go. Let's take it down. So, he is immune to almost everything. See if we can expose a weak point. Four hundred and sixty two thousand health. We're sitting here battling, I'm like, his stuff's not going down. Girl Lightning and his boy Odin.
Falci running the Sanctum. Then, I guess it wasn't Eden controlling things after all. As I said, <laughs> I am Lord Sovereign. Guess Falci don't go down as easy as the rest of us. Ease is not the issue. You have not fought to win. You should know quite well already the sure way of dispatching our kind. Ragnarok. What's Ragnarok? Ah! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Pitiful the scene. You've forgotten your focus. Ragnarok is the beast. One of you must become in order to lay waste to Cocoon. You have had the dream. One among you will become that monstrosity. Defeat Orphan and destroy Cocoon. Orphan? The font of Eden's power. Orphan fuels Eden with strength. And Eden, in turn, sustains you and the rest of our kind. Destroy Orphan, and you'll release a force such as this world has never seen. Cocoon will be torn asunder. So if I did that, destroyed Orphan... <laughs> Your focus will be fulfilled. So what? Who says it has to be? Sarah asked us to save Cocoon before she turned to crystal. Save it! And that's what we're gonna do. Sarah was trying to tell us how to complete our focus, and we have... <laughs> Allow me to help you see the truth of things. The moment you arrived, your friend wept crystal tears. This was because her focus required that you be brought together. That girl did nothing but assemble the tools for Cocoon's destruction. Did it never occur to you? Or did you simply refuse to countenance the thought? If you will not face the truth, then face the peril of your plight. How stark reality is. Come on. This is bad. The yoke's jammed. What? Knew it was a trap. <laughs> Something's coming! Not so fast, Lassie. Hang on! What kind of ship is this? Fighting on its own? Clever, aren't you? Can we do something? Got me? I give up!
How do you drive full speed into a building and don't even look at the building? for Lissy to accept their fate. Do you really think our focus is what Dysley said it is? You mean, become Ragnarok? Destroy the foul CE and shatter Cocoon. That's what the vision's telling us, more or less. <sighs> so, back to square one. Out of luck. To hero, cocoon calling snow. It's almost like Dysley wants it to come true. Seems that way. He sure didn't mind explaining it. Here's your focus on the silver platter. But that doesn't make sense. I don't get it. Why would a cocoon foul sea want to destroy cocoon? Maybe it's a Falci thing. You know what I mean? Some grand design we just don't understand. Huh. Hey, Snow. Nothing from you? back with just lightning. I don't know if there's any treasure or not here, but I'm definitely going to look around. Nothing up there. Save. Chapter 10. Alright, so where is Help and Vanille? I think that's Vanille up front. And there's Hope. Focus. 
enough like you to second guess yourself. Oh, well, even heroes make mistakes. What about your plan to protect Cocoon? Either way, your faith in Sarah was strong. That strength got you this far. It was all wrong. Yeah. You tried so hard to convince us that you even fooled yourself. <laughs> You've been a total idiot. But still... It saved me. You trusted Sarah. Let that faith drive you. It even made me want to believe. Hey, uh... This couldn't be... I mean... Those were just legends, right? I want to say we're close to Eden, but... It's hard to be sure. See, hey, that... Not look like we can go on the other side of the train, so... Up, up we go. Pulsework Knights. Easy. Your party members have unlocked the potential to assume all combat roles. From now on, you can freely select the members of your battle team to take on a new role. A member must first learn the ability for that role. You can teach the party members via Christidium. Christidium. Fifth Arc, Concealed Vestige. This place, it must be an Ark. An Ark? That's what they called them. Long ago, the Falci who made their home on Grand Pulse were afraid of invasion from the outside. As part of their battle preparations, they created an army of living weapons. And they stored those weapons in arcs. And they hid the arcs all over the world. Everyone on Grand Pulse knew the legend. So, this is basically a Pulse armory. Mm hmm. Most of us never believed in them. A few people tried searching, but they never found a thing. Who'd have thought to look on Cocoon? Right under our noses. Some secret they kept. Those oh, Sanctum guys, what are they up to? The story's not done. There's more. They used to say the Arcs had a more practical purpose. Hmm. Huh. Really? Yeah. To force Lassie to master their shiny new powers. Huh. Okay. So, I get it. Dysley's goal is to forge us into stronger weapons. Right. Not Seath, but monsters all the same. 
Think of it as training for the fight ahead. Herb's right. Wait. Uh, what was that? Ah, uh, these guys again. Fun times. Over there. We gotta keep moving. I'm not gonna run from him, we're gonna kill him. I think, yeah, we've already got everything for it. And we are bringing our battle team back to my girls. There we go. Turning us around again? I'm wanting to look around. Alright, so this is where we came in. Just like make sure we didn't miss anything. Treasure spear, no treasure sphere. So I guess we came in, we walked up a few flights of steps, and that was that. All right, we got bomb pulse soldier. Oh, well, you killed the bomb before I can even get a lightoscope off. I think you're going to continue to do that. So I may need to... I'm in the battle. at least once. Oh well, that crap. Swap it for a second to kill these guys. Heroes Ambulance. Before I go up, is there anything back here? That would have been a perfect place to hide some. The 
temporarily switch it. Keep out of this. On your knees. All right, so we now know what all our stuff is. Develop characters further. You're able to harness full powers of a Lassie. Your characters can now master any role. You'll be able to use a new role once you've learned one of its abilities. Master a variety of roles and you'll gain access to more versatile paragrams. Yeah. Gain a chain bonus and stagger a target when attacking. So you're fully mastered in that. Power chain. Instantly slay a target with low HP. We're not going to level up everyone and everything right now. So that maxed you out on that. Alright, so what do we got going on? We go back down or we go up? We're gonna go back down. Cause now we need a lot of CP. OP. Bombshells. Nothing here. It's so weird that they made these spaces and they didn't put some there. Let's get this over with. We're getting more and more free reign over our characters. Soon I think we'll actually be able to go wherever we want. To an extent. Oh, <laughs> 
barely was able to get that thing off to scan them before we killed them all. Saints amulet. Don't know what that does. Time to battle the ooey gooeys. There's something over here on the other side. All right, so we need to go this way. Must kill. Look at these guys. Hey, there's like seven of them, though. Back me up. Gonna hit one. Alright, so this, like this, place. this is how we get over here. Again, making things needlessly big for no reason. Dude, there are so many of these. We scan this whole area. I know even the Falci are big creatures, but like this, this room over here is just ridiculous in size. We've already seen that the Falci can shrink their cells in size too, so there's no point in the room being so big. Rainbow Anklet. That's good. A little bit more in Ravenger.
Did I miss something here? This ability... I'm missing two abilities and the strength. Oh, I didn't see this went down. Oops. Go ahead and do a few with hope. I don't know if we're going to get split up again anytime soon, but just in case, we want everybody to be nice and strong. Thundra. You're maxed out on those two. Now Sentinel. Alright. Everybody's doing a lot better now. Should be quite a bit stronger. Let's see, do we got anything in the shop? We got a lot in the shop. Lifesaver. Healer's Staff. Gold Bangle. Witch's Bracelet. There's magic resistance. Creature comforts. Monster Fang, the worldly bone. Try to keep at least one of everything. I guess we're battling. You know what to do. They both drop sturdy bones. Let's see. We're not gonna take an elevator or whatnot just yet. I wanna look around. Whoa. Where 
am I? That threw me off completely. I just went the long way for no reason. You know what to do. Just another battle. Previous level. Okay, so it's just jump down points by the looks of it. I don't need the quick jump down points, I'll do the walk around. Two bombs, Nothing two birds, or one bomb, two birds. I don't know if there's anything else down at this store. I think this keeps going down. No, it goes way up. That's hard to say, because why not? Well, that doesn't look good. Hibernation fifth arc. Bring it on. Do all of them at once. On your toes. Transformer and amplifier. Immune to fire. Weak to electricity. I got him. Oh. 
Take him out. With having two commanders, we're just like keeping things in the air till they die. Alright, so there's one item over here. Rigels. I want to see if we can get these other ones. Is there a way to trigger you? Thank you, man. Not gonna do it with everybody. Ravenger, good. Oh, saboteur. Alright. Kinda curious. I feel like they should be able to be summoned. Conduit. Oh. The power within. There's an item. At least one item. One shot at all of them. I was trying to scan a man. Alright, hopefully we find more imps. Switch you to that one. So I get a chance to scan the elves. Let's get this The torn leather smooth hide. And then. Guys, <laughs> I 
And now with the fire in the distance. Big beast boy right here. On your toes. Greater behemoth. All right. There's really not been a lot of uh, items down here. Item right here. Got a feeling there's something around. Dude, why is there so much red here? Is there ten of them? Let's just take us to the same location. Kinda looks like it. Definitely clearing a house here. Can't jump down, so I literally have to walk around. Come at me, big boy. Or big girl. We can win if you stay focused. There we go. We're coming up to another train station. I think imps can summon things. Be ready for the next fight. And 
Another shout, shroud, shout. These are all elves, right? Yeah. Metal armband. I don't think there's anything else back here. Oh. Alright, spend a little more crystal. Trying to do the crystal at like each of the little save stations. You're maxed out there. And at both of those. Commando, Sentinel, Habitula. We have one more there. Ravenger is good. Avatar has one more. It's good. Ah, right beforehand. Are we outside? Sanctum officer. He's been helping us out. Uh, why are you here? <sighs> Rain. You traitor! I put you on the path. That was my focus. <laughs> what? You're a C? Since long before we met. I did my best to assist you, as bid by the Sanctum Falci. Now do you understand? The Falci have watched over you, guiding your every step. The luck that saved you time and again was a deliberate machination. Why, you may ask? The Primarch, or should I say, Bartandalus, is crafting you into the instruments of Cocoon's demise. We've been played for fools. A cocoon foul sea? Why? Why? To restore the Maker. The Maker? The entity responsible for creating both humans and foul sea. <laughs> the Maker departed this world, leaving the two races behind. In a sense, human and Falci are brothers, orphaned by the same parent. As for the humans, they forgot the order imposed by the Maker. They began to war amongst themselves for the first time in history. The Falci focused on recalling their lost deity and returning the world to its former glory. This purpose lies at the heart of all their actions. 
calling back the Maker requires a fitting sacrifice. Yeah, we've heard. The destruction of Cocoon. The lives of this world's entire populace in bloody tribute. No, that's crazy talk. I don't get it. Why do they need us? Couldn't the Fauci end Cocoon with just a thought? Their existence is bound to the creation and maintenance of this floating shell. It is their very nature that holds them in check. You mean Cocoon Fauci can't destroy Cocoon? They needed tools. If we can stop this by doing nothing, we'll do nothing. Noble, I expected as much. Lie to us. What happened to your dream of rebuilding Cocoon for the people? Was it all a lie? A shadow of a dream from when I was human. It was change I craved. And once I'd built the influence to make things happen, there was change. I gained all the power I could hope for, but was a puppet with no will to wield it. It wasn't the foul sea who changed. It was me. You... you were made a Lassie? A Lassie. Tied to an inescapable focus. A slave of destiny. I'd lost hope. I'd all but given up on dreams of freedom. What are you saying? I'm here of my own accord, not by foul sea order. Seeing you fight... ...brought it all back. Brought back that future I once strove for. I, too... ...will challenge my fate. plan will fail. Rains! I will use all my remaining power. I will set you free! Rains. Hey, <laughs> oh yeah, it drops a crown. Complete his focus? I don't think so. All Reigns did was try to save Cocoon in his own way. His own way. What? Hey! Where are you? Snow! I think Reigns was searching. Searching for a way to make us understand. To understand the frustration of being a Lassie. A Lassie bound to a focus. And maybe what it meant to be human.
Well, we're going to call it an episode there. Thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Tell me what you think in the comment section down below. See you guys in the next episode. Have a wonderful day. God bless. Peace.